I'm Janet Rossent, President and Scientific Director of the Gairdner Foundation. I'm excited to be here today to announce the 2021 recipients of the Canada Gairdner Awards, another incredible group of scientists. Built on the initial vision of Jim Gairdner, a Canadian stockbroker and philanthropist, the Canada Gairdner Awards have continually grown in prestige over the years. Over the years, we've awarded 395 scientists and researchers from over 35 countries for their incredible work. And I'm pleased to be announcing a new class of individuals who would join that group today. There are three types of Canada Gairdner Awards. The Canada Gairdner International Awards for Biomedical Research, the John Dirk Canada Gairdner Global Health Award, specifically for impact on global health issues, and the Canada Gairdner Whiteman Award, reserved for a Canadian scientist showcasing scientific excellence and leadership. I encourage you all to please share the news on Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook using the hashtag Gairdner and tagging us at Gairdner Awards. At Gairdner, we pride ourselves on the caliber of our awardees who are selected through our robust adjudication process, which involves leading scientists from all corners of the globe. I'd like to thank the members of our medical review panel, the medical advisory board, the Global Health and the Whiteman Award adjudication committees for their hard work in selecting this year's outstanding cohort. I'd also like to take a moment to thank our supporters. Again, I would like to thank our presenting sponsor, Power Corporation of Canada, for their generous support of today's announcement. To learn more about this organization, please visit the sponsor room after the presentation. The federal government through CIHR has been a long time partner and their commitment is essential to our programming across the country that gives students, trainees, faculty members and the public access to groundbreaking science that is changing our world. The Gairdner Foundation is also supported by our media partner, The Globe and Mail, who help us bring our laureate science to the public. The Canada Gairdner International Awards recognize seminal discoveries that have a broad impact on biomedical science and health outcomes. The first 2021 Canada Gairdner International Award laureates are Dr. Daniel Drucker, Dr. Gerald Habner, and Dr. Jens Holtz. They are awarded for research on glucagon-like peptides that has led to major advances in the treatment of type 2 diabetes, obesity, and intestinal disorders. For trailblazing discoveries on how our bodies use energy every day and how this is disrupted in disease, the 2021 Canada Gairdner International Award goes to Dr. Daniel Drucker, Dr. Joel Habener, and Dr. Jens Joel Holst. Our gut is a key interface between our bodies and the outside world. When our gut and organs like our pancreas or liver aren't controlling our metabolism properly, gut hormones come to the rescue to help balance things. Drucker, Habener, and Holst discovered gut hormones known as GLP-1 and GLP-2, which impact other hormones, such as insulin and glucagon to help maintain healthy sugar levels. They have revolutionized type 2 diabetes treatment by outlining the biology of GLP-1 and decoding how these hormones signal to the body. The result is two major new classes of drugs, the DPP-4 inhibitors and the GLP-1 receptor agonists, which are now standard drug therapies for type 2 diabetes. Further, this led to a new effective class of GLP-1 therapies for people with obesity. Drucker and Holst's understanding of GLP-2 has also revolutionized treatment for countless children and adults with short bowel disease by decreasing the need for intravenous feeding. The three scientists' trailblazing research from the lab to the clinic has changed treatment for diabetes worldwide. Over 100 million people with type 2 diabetes have been treated as a direct result of their discoveries. Therapies that not only lower glucose, but decrease body weight and reduce the rates of heart disease. Congratulations to Dr. Drucker, Hamner, and Holst. Our next 2021 Canada Gardner International Award Laureate is Dr. Mary Claire King. Dr. King is awarded for transforming cancer genetics and oncology with the discovery of inherited susceptibility to breast cancer due to mutation of the BRCA1 gene. 
an evolutionary perspective based on studies of genetic differences between humans and chimpanzees, led to insights into cancer in human families. The 2021 Canada Gardner International Award goes to Dr. Mary Claire King for breakthrough achievements in genetics. As a graduate student, King studied evolution at the molecular level in natural populations. This led to her first breakthrough, finding that a small number of critical genetic differences are responsible for the great differences in body shape and lifestyle between humans and chimpanzees. King then shifted her focus to studying families severely affected by breast cancer, searching for the genetic basis of their illness. Using mathematical and molecular approaches, she found that a small number of critical mutations were responsible for the high risk of each of these severely affected families. These mutations were clustered in the same gene, which she named BRCA1. King's discovery of BRCA1 and the subsequent discovery of BRCA2 made it possible to identify women at very high risk of breast and ovarian cancer and enable preventative treatment. King's discovery has transformed cancer genetics as a whole, impacting countless lives around the world. Congratulations to Dr. King. Next, I'd like to announce our 2021 John Dirks Canada Gardner Global Health Award. This award is given to a scientist or scientists whose advances have, or will potentially have, a significant impact on health outcomes in the developing world. The 2021 John Dirks Canada Gardner Global Health Award for Outstanding Achievements in Global Health Research goes to Dr. Yi Guan and Dr. Malik Peres. They are awarded for significantly contributing to understanding the origins and options for control of newly emerging infectious disease outbreaks in Asia, notably zoonotic influenza and severe acute respiratory syndrome or SARS. Before the world was watching COVID-19, they were monitoring viral disease outbreaks, identifying their origins and developing ways to block spread. The 2021 John Dirks Canada Gardner Global Health Award goes to Drs. Yi Wang and Malik Pires. After the avian flu outbreak in 1997, Guan and Pires partnered at the University of Hong Kong to develop a surveillance program, which revealed that live poultry markets were the source of virus spread from animals to humans. This led to interventions in live poultry markets across Asia, limited spread of the disease, and provided insights into how zoonotic influenza viruses emerge. Following the emergence of SARS in China in 2003, Pyrrhus led the identification of the coronavirus. Information was shared worldwide, enabling research that has subsequently played an integral role in developing treatments and vaccines against COVID-19. Meanwhile, Guan helped avert a potential reoccurrence of SARS by showing that coronaviruses also are found in animal hosts before jumping to humans. The crucial closure of wild game markets helped contain the spread of SARS. Guan and Pierce's investigation of H5 influenza strains and SARS-CoV-1, along with their open sharing of information with the WHO and the broader international community, has been a model for scientific collaboration in the current COVID-19 pandemic. Congratulations to Dr. Guan and Dr. Pierce. Finally, I'd like to announce the winner of the 2021 Canada Gardner Whiteman Award. This award goes to a Canadian health researcher whose career demonstrates extraordinary leadership paired with exceptional science. The 2021 Canada Gardner Whiteman Award goes to Dr. Elizabeth Eisenhower. Dr. Eisenhower is awarded for investigation of new cancer drugs and delivery approaches leading to change in cancer clinical trials and establishing new standards of cancer treatment that have impacted patients around the world. For bettering the fight of cancer patients worldwide, the 2021 Canada Gardner Whiteman Award goes to Dr. Elizabeth Eisenhower. Eisenhower is being awarded for transforming cancer drug delivery and establishing new standards of cancer treatment, impacting patients around the world. Her career presided over 200 clinical trials, involving more than 5,500 patients and more than 100 cancer-fighting drugs. 
She has been fundamental in the evaluation of new anti-cancer agents and research strategy. While being a catalyst to the treatment of ovarian cancer, malignant melanoma, and brain tumors. She designed and led a study to evaluate a novel method of administrating Taxol, one of the most important cancer drugs worldwide. This shorter and safer method of administration has improved the lives of countless cancer patients and has become an international standard. Eisenhower's commitment to the advancement of cancer therapy is unparalleled as she continues not only her research, but leadership across Canada. Congratulations to Dr. Eisenhower. As Gairdner's president, I'm thrilled to invite these seven individuals into the Gairdner family, a distinguished group of researchers responsible for many of the world's most significant advances in science. A large part of Gairdner's core mandate is inspiring the next generation of researchers, innovators, and leaders through our pan-Canadian outreach programs. Over the course of 2021, Gairdner will send our laureates virtually this year across Canada to share their science and stories with faculty members, trainees, high school students and the public. Please check out gerner.org for a full listing of all our events, including symposia and public lectures. Follow us on social media and subscribe to our newsletter to get updated information about everything Gerner. Congratulations again to our 2021 Canada Gerner Awardees.